put on your wetsuit or your bathing suit or just jumped in without getting in trouble, you would probably land in about knee deep of like the finest, muckiest muck, which is really just kind of the legacy of human use and a dysfunctional ecosystem where over a couple hundred years, the fine grain nutrients build up so much. Um, and at, at that point, there's no plant life and hardly any animal life left to help process and digest and turn those nutrients into something else, like root structure, like leaves, like eelgrass that can live in the intertidal zone. So once the ecosystem is largely dead, that's what oyster reefs were for hundreds of years. It was sort of the housing stock of the harbor because it wasn't just the oysters who lived there. It was the small fish that you know, saw protection there. It was the big fish that fed on the small fish there. It was the oyster reef that provided the substrate for the plants to 